A quiz bank is designed as a resource area where a teacher or team of teachers can store many test questions to be used later for specific tests. As such, you will always create a quiz bank in a resource area. So I basically have two options. I can go up to my resources and choose my personal resources. I can create a collection using the add collection button called quiz banks or quizzes for biology or really whatever I want to call it. And I can share this collection using the sharing button with any of the other instructors who would be contributing test questions to the bank. To add the quiz bank from here, I simply use the add resources button and select add question bank. Alternately, if you already have a group set up for those that you collaborate with, you could simply go into your group, go into the group's resources, and again use the add resources button to add a question bank. You can use the add question button to compose test questions right from within the bank. For most of us will probably have existing quiz questions that we'd rather import into the new question bank. So now I'm going to switch over to one of my courses and find an existing quiz that I want to use to add questions to this question bank. Once you have navigated to the quiz that contains the questions you want to add to the question bank, simply go to the questions tab of the quiz and use the options button to add questions to the quiz bank. You can select all of the questions on your quiz or use the check marks to select just those questions you want to add to the bank and click the next button. You'll now need to tell Schoology which question bank you want these questions to be added to and from here I can create a new question bank or I can go into my shared groups, find the group where I have located my question bank and add the questions this way. Now that I have added questions to a question bank, and my colleagues have as well, I'll show you how to import those questions into one of your quizzes. Simply navigate to your course and to the folder where you wish to add this new quiz created from questions composed of those that already exist in the question bank, and choose the Add Materials button to add an online test or quiz. Title the quiz and add in the maximum points, although you may need to adjust this later based on how many questions you decide to pull in. And make sure to assign a grading category. If you don't have any assigned, quickly create a new one. After your quiz is created, go to the Questions tab and use the Add Questions button and use the option to add a question from a question bank. Again, you'll navigate to the collection or the group, which contains the common question bank. Select the appropriate question bank. And from this screen, I can either select all questions from the question bank, or I can select individual questions manually, or I can go to the auto select menu and I can say how many questions I want and add Schoology to randomly choose those. I can also set the point value for the questions right here. And when I am finished, I just need to select the blue add questions button. I've successfully added those questions in from the common question bank. I can continue to add additional questions to my quiz if I'd like to, or I can leave it as is, making sure I adjust the final points because I can see right now that my quiz is only worth 14 points, so I would need to go into my quiz settings and adjust the maximum points to 14. And remember that you also have additional settings on the settings tab, which allow you to randomize the order of the questions. And also remember you always need to go in and make your quiz available now or set the dates that it will be available for your students, otherwise they won't be able to see this quiz.